Hello everybody, welcome back to more Let's Play Banjo-Kazooie! On the last episode, we did some minor outside stuff, exterior stuff, and uh, we unlocked this level, which is called... Ah, uh, the name just skipped me. Crap. Uh, it's gonna come, it's gonna come. Click, click Cluck Woods, there it is. Ah, get it? Because click, cluck, you'll, you'll get it one later when we get into the level. But anyway, uh, welcome back. Um... And this level is based on a time zone thing, where it's like uh, it's split up into four parts. That you have you have a huge hub world, which I showed at the last part of the last episode, or the, not the last one, previous episode. So this is the springing variation of Click Lock Wood. It uh, well basically a spring. It's great, you know. The leaves haven't fully grown. There's uh, it's raining in some places. Um, you know, just spring things. And it's got one of the best music soundtracks. I love it. It's, uh, up, up there next to Rusty Bucket Bay and, uh, I don't know, Freezy Zizi Peak. I can actually never say that. Frizzy Zizi Peak. Freezy Zizi Peak. It's hard to pronounce, honestly. Anyway, so, uh,. In this map, there's a huge oak tree, or whatever tree you want to call it, just it sprouts at the middle, and it never changes. Well, the insides never change, but the surroundings around it change, so. You're going to be climbing up this a lot. Maybe falling like I do, so it's great, yeah. I decided to get this out of the way and just, like, totally, let's do this! Yeah, come on, it's like... 12:52 in the in, in, at night, and I got stuff in the morning, but I don't care. I need to get this done and over with. So anyway, um, you can't go through there. That'll become important later. So yeah, you'll notice that because some areas are accessible at different times. So that beehive is probably accessible in the summer and fall, while the uh, while uh, the mumbo's Mumbo Jumbo Tut is accessible only in the spring, so keep that in mind. Oh, and you'll also see progress over time, so this uh, wooden house, this tree house, is uh, obviously not finished. You got wooden planks that just hang up the... What? You got... Okay, and then you have floating planks that... Okay. Um, never mind that. So, over time, probably in winter, all these things will probably be finished. But at the worst time, I mean, who wants to hang out in a treehouse when it's like zero degrees outside? Anyway, you see these buttons? They will unlock the other seasons. So now we just unlock summer. So therefore, we can go to summer and be all like, Yeah, it's warm and hot now. Ah, ha, ha. Anyway, in here, you'll see a nutty thing. Chomp, chomp, chew. Nabut night likes Nabut likes acorns. I think I'll have some more. He gets really funny later. I can't remember. I think it's in winter, but yeah, he's he really does like acorns. Yeah. Anyway, be careful with these ledges. They are actually pretty difficult, especially when I was first playing this game. That would be. Uh, I can't. I can't remember, there's countless times where I kept falling. It was horrible. Anyway, back here, upon this giant egg, upon... What am I? Oh, well. You'll notice a giant blue X. And of course, with blue Xs, we smash them. And look at that. Eerie, mighty eagle. Needs sleeps now. So yeah, we just gave labor. I don't know if I could post this on YouTube anymore. And he's, he's very slippery. Mm. Yeah, I'm not going to think about that. Anyway. If you uh, climb up here, you could do this at actually any season. Winter's the easiest. But uh, if you're daring like I am, you can just leap on over and jump up, get a few. Actually, you actually have to come up here in spring. I just forgot. That Jinjo uh, only is here in the springtime. The Jinjos are in uh, different variations, and probably, not probably, they are in their uh, color-coordinated area thing. 
Like, uh, there was a green Jinjo in spring. That's great. There's a yellow Jinjo, dev devilishly hidden in a summer. Uh, orange for fall. Uh, blue for winter. And purple for... I, I don't know. We'll find out later, won't we? <laughs> purple shall be the missing season that the Romans or wh whoever figured our out our um, seasons. Anywho, if you come over here, you'll see a very uh, dark, dark dirt. This should be dark chocolate. Huh. And there is a hole in the middle. And what we tend to do with holes is throw eggs in them. So let us do this. This again uh, just totally destroys the freaking. Look at that. Look at that. Our eggs grow a flower. That doesn't even make sense. It, it doesn't. Sorry, I'm screaming into the mic. <laughs> oh well. Ignore it. It's video games and their logic of stuff. So you can you can't kill that bull, like I said earlier, so he's just a annoying part of the level. That annoying part and annoying zit you can't get rid of because it hurts too much. So uh there uh those birds that we keep seeing are um those slug things, um, but you know, they were uh, modified for this uh, for this level. Whoa, a whopping 34 gold skull it does uh, silver scones things. Anyway, this will be the last time we ever get to actually use Mumbo. Well, yeah. So you know. Oh well. Actually. I am wrong, but it's more of a cheat than anything else. So we'll get to that um, at the end of the Let's Play. Hint the hint. So now that we're a bee, we can uh, fly around. Um, you can speed up using well, whatever your system you have. I think it's A, maybe Z. I don't know. Nintendo was weird like that. Bees on wings, guarding Grunty's holding golden piece. We've been told there's a honey bear out there. Okay, see, look, there's the purple in spring, but it's in the bees' honey hive. I think I think yellow would probably fit more better in there, but of course I wouldn't know, I guess. Anyway. Ooh, excuse me. That, uh, you know, that's pretty much it for uh, spring except for one more thing um, only when you're a bee you can come up here and there's a very rude jiggy hidden up here basically what you do is you surround the tree and do all the events around the tree okay you don't get hurt from fall damage either so it's great and that pretty much uh, clears spring. We don't need to be here anymore. Crap, I lost my train of thought. Um, major cut. <clears throat> Sorry. Okay, um, yeah, so the bee will only work in springtime and outside in the hub and a little further than that. So, he's pretty versatile, except for when he comes into, uh, you know, the other worlds that are just the next room over, but whatever. Maybe it's a time thingy. Anyway, remember that, uh, Jinjo, the yellow Jinjo I was talking about? Look at that. Look at that. That was just so devilish. I can't say devilishly. That was just very hard to find. It was just, like, out there and it blended. He had camo. Eek! Hungry animals like caterpillars! Dot, dot, dot. Hint, hint, hint. Get it? I taste delicious. And you're gonna get that cutscene every time you enter the new, uh, area. So, um, enjoy that. And now you can see, whoa, what happened to all the water? 
Well, it's uh, summer, so I guess it all got evaporated. Yeah, there are clouds now. Isn't that great? <laughs> and you notice that we can't get up here. We're like, oh, darn. That's because, uh, like I said, some events, some areas are not accessible until you actually get there. Uh, to a different season, sorry. Anyway, now that button shall unlock the, uh, fall. Fall. It's autumn or fall. I always call it fall. When I first heard about him, I'm like, that's a girl in my neighborhood. What are you talking about? Yeah, you know, it's kind of weird. So I'll, I'll just continue calling it Fall. Anyway, uh, <laughs> yeah, so the Robin Hood bad guys and whatnot now have their shirts off. Because it's hot outside, man. And, uh, you can't turn in the B in here. Even though it seems perfect, honestly, I think the B better suits the summer area better, but whatever. I do not make the games here. I just play them. <clears throat> and now you'll notice down there, who could it be? Oh, never mind. We'll ignore him for now, because there's a caterpillar, and he is way more important than a caterpillar. Anyway, it is... Oh no, it's you two again! Gobi thought he was safe here! Will you stop doing that? It took me ages to find more water. So yeah, you can, uh, more, um, animal abusement by, uh, stomping on their back, and then he becomes invincible to our things, so, uh, yeah. So now we have a pretty nice flower. It's still not blooming, but, you know, we're getting there. It takes a real farmer. We are farmers. Alright. So we need, um... Uh, ten? I think we need ten worms, so, uh... We actually think there's twenty per level. I actually don't know the exact number. I'm just making this up. There, uh, but yeah, there's more than just ten, so you don't need to freak out about freak out about finding every single one. So yeah, um, we got time. Okay, now you notice that uh, there's this was a path back in the spring, but since the leaves have not bloomed, they were just these little scrawny things that you can only move two steps on. So uh, <laughs> it's best just to wait till uh. Summer, and I don't think that you can even get this jiggy until summer. So, yeah, we'll get that and uh, continue on our way. I don't know if this is a faster way up to uh, up the tree, but uh, it uh, it's much harder if you want to take your chance at it. Or you could choose the smart way and just climb up with uh, Kazooie and her trotto top. Hey, I actually, I actually called Kazooie a girl. <laughs> That's weird. I usually call him a boy. Her. A... Never mind. Anyway. So yeah, like I was saying, you climb up this tree a lot. So get used to it. <laughs> I think the least amount of times you climb up it is in winter because there's like one thing you need to do. Anyway, you'll notice there's like a huge indent in here. And we'll get to that next time. See you guys. Bye. Time ran out. Sorry.